Hello, my name is Rosanna Griffin, I'm an author, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Since we are all stuck at home with this, because of this thing, you know, the thing, it doesn't need to be named, sort of like Voldemort. <laughs> um, I am amusing myself with my camera, so I figured I would, uh, you know, create a YouTube channel. So I'm doing the AuthorTube newbie tag today. So let's just dive into the questions so this video isn't too long. Question number one, how did you find out about AuthorTube? I found out about AuthorTube because I had a friend who was on AuthorTube for a while, so I watched her videos and then branched off into watching a bunch of other people's videos, and I think it's a pretty cool community. Two, what genres do you write in? I write in fantasy and science fiction. Less science fiction, more fantasy, but in the, the like, spectrum that is fantasy and science fiction, I've written pretty much all along the spectrum, so. That is what I write. Um, what is your preferred tense, point of view, and category? So my preferred tense is definitely third person past. However, that will change depending on the story. So I write in first person, I write in third person. I've Have I done anything in third person plural? I don't think so. I've written present tense, past tense. Um, oh, and I write uh, for adults. Are you a plotter, pantser, or planter? Yes. It depends on the genre. I'm sorry. It depends on the length of story. I tend to completely pants flash fiction. I tend to be a lot more intentional with short stories and novel length uh, pieces. Five. Are you self-published, published, or yet to be published? I am yet to be published. That's it. Six, what publishing company, literary agent, and or printing company are you re represented by or use? If you're not yet published, what is your dream publishing house and or literary agent? I'm not at that point in my journey. I, so I actually don't know. I, at this point, am planning on going to the traditional publishing route. So, you know, you always dream about being, like, bought, having a piece bought by, like, one of the big five, but... Who knows? I do care, but I'm not picky. Uh, what authortube related videos can we expect to find on your channel? You can expect vlogs. You can expect um, process videos. You can expect journey videos, the occasional rant, the occasional this is what's on my brain right now. Um, maybe some sit down chatty videos, maybe some like discussions into craft as it relates to what I'm doing. What you can will not find on my videos, I'm not gonna do <laughs> I say this now, I'm not going to do teaching videos. My goal is not to come on and teach you how to write. My goal is to merely show you the my process and what I'm doing. Um, eight, when did I start writing? Uh, 2012. Uh, my, a little bit earlier than that, but 2012 was when I sat down and intentionally started writing. I had a friend tell me about NaNoWriMo the weekend before I started, and I had had this story idea bounce around in my brain for years and years and years, and so um, I, I wrote it during NaNoWriMo 2012 instead of planning my wedding. <laughs> Nine, what was the first story you ever wrote? The first story I ever finished was a short story I wrote for a creative writing class in college, and then the first novel I ever finished was the novel that I wrote in 2012 for NaNoWriMo, and so I finished it like early 2013. What uh, authors have inspired your writing the most? Whew, um, that's a hard one. So there's like the, the authors that I connected to as a young person who I continue to love, like Tamara Pierce. And then there's like the authors that I read today who inspire me to write better. Um, and that's someone like Jennifer Egan or, uh, I'm blanking on names, but there's like the nostalgia and like the things that I love and the things that like brought me to writing. And then there's like the people whose stuff that is just like so amazing that I that like I want to be like them. So Tamara Pierce and Jennifer Egan. 
Do you schedule your writing sessions or simply get to writing whenever you can find the time? I have ADHD. That means my brain works really well with a schedule. That also means I hate schedules. So yes. <laughs> 12, do you type on a typewriter, computer, write anything by hand, or a blend? Computer all the way. Sometimes I brainstorm by longhand, but computer all the way. All right, and last question. What are you most looking forward to now that you are part of AuthorTube? Well, I think probably the community. I'm an extrovert and finding other people who write is uh, actually very important to me. So yeah, definitely the community. All right, so you know the drill. Like, subscribe, comment. Um, it's nice to meet you all. I hope to see you around and stay tuned for more, well, for vlogs. I can't say for more vlogs because there aren't any up yet. All right, talk to you later.